Good evening YouTube, and this is Ryan Smith, aka Fox, and this is Sunday night of Auto Assembly 2011. It's all over. Well, uh, we've got a couple of good things, and a couple of bad, still got my foot in the cast. That's a nice twist. Last year Jasmine broke her leg and couldn't go, this year I broke mine and went anyway. Oh well. So then, we have, of course, the swag to see. Now, I'm going to take a long little stagger backward, just to let you see how much I've managed to cover this bed. Yeah, I am pretty happy with how that went, considering I crutched around all the time. Really need to ask Jasmine for tips on that. Let's start up the top here. Got here, charity auction. This is Michael Chain, voice of Powerglide. Managed to win that. I have a little Beast Wars segment here, Tarantulas. And I think that's Tasmania Kid, not sure. Got Tasmania complete for £1, the total ransom. Over here, we have a little Armada section in mini cottons. Overload. And this is, dear, I keep forgetting his name, will come back to me, but it was very important, I'm sure it will. Minicons, these are going to Jasmine, except for the Sky Boom Shield, I am keeping that rather for myself. And Cybertronian Soundwave and Megatron, War for Cybertrons. I could actually tell you a lot about what's going where and who it is to, but for the purpose of brevity, we will just try and keep it to who is here and who is not. As you'll see, I do want to, however, torment Jasmine. Look, I have a Sergeant Cup, and he has his cigar. Wonderful stuff. Now, all this here. Someone who is not in the Beast Wars section and stands alone is Black Leo Convoy. I purchased him after Lee Bradley drew this. Yes. What started out as just a regular Leo Convoy, he took the overshadowing and the feral picture wonderfully. So I just had to have that. This one, I'll tell you, this one is Jasmine's. This is the Not Reflector, the PE-11. Had to play around with that. I'll put it back in the box before I meal it off, but fun. Got a nice little G1 corner here, Skyfall. The Action Master who can turn into anything except with a moral conscience. And we have here Top Spin and Twin Twist. As you can see, I went for a bit of a Wreckers theme. A Huffer. And we have the Kiss Players cassette box. Uh, this is another Jasmine item. We have Glit here, who we found very special. We were going to make a story about this cassette, but did not come to fruition. She may continue it herself, who knows. But Glit. Not Shark Glass Ravage. Lit. Down here, I have begun troop building. Sky Stalkers. One in the box, one regular, one Sunspot, and one G2. All to go along with Jason Cardi's picture. Nicely. We'll have a look at some items here, which are drawn specifically for Jasmine. Beast Wars and several animal themes. We have here Silverbolt. These are all done by Cat Nicholson, who went with regular Ravage and Rat Trap to Shattered Glass Ravage and Rat Trap. That was pretty fun. Over here, of all the bits left of the Wreckers, Overlord. Nick Roche print. And Nick Roche, although he did not have time to do a full sketch, 
he was a very wanted and busy man. He did create this, which is a one-minute sketch of Bayonet from Infestation. Uh, hmm. Jasmine's favourite, uh, don't know what I think. It's about a tragedy that we do not have more Decepticon females, but, well, there we are. I will not do anything of spoilers, but check out Infestation, even if you go for just the Transformer stuff. Nefarious. And this is what Greg Berger signed for Jasmine. The full Transformers movie poster. I'll have that here. We have one Optimal Optimus. I've just got to play around the figure. I'm not sure what I think, but £15, not bad. And we have a little animated section. This was bought to be stripped for parts. £10, Stealth Lockdown. He is going to be basically given to Jasmine so she can steal his EMP generator. This one is mine, as I thought the gold would go well with Physitron. And one final item for Jasmine. Animated Cheetor. I'm trying to come to grips with the fact that although Jasmine did not attend, she has possibly spent more than me with the money that she gave or wired as needed. A couple of things down here. This is a large stack of items that were signed. Just some this year. Last year this was Beast Machines, signed by Gary Chalk, now signed by David Kay. And this one, Jasmine, I hope you will find very special. It is, of course, the girl who loved Power Glide. David Wise took a very nice shine to yourself, which you'll soon see. And Power Glide loves you, apparently. Here's looking at you. Oh, let's see. Now, as part of this, if you've managed to wear this way through the video this far, I possibly should have split these up further soon. Because inside here is a surprise for one Malinus T. Actually, a couple of surprises. Ta-da! We have put aside a few comics, as Mal has not really read much. Note that one is definitely mine, thank you. We've put a few aside in here, just for him to look through the infestation and ongoing series as well as something that I had all the guests look at throughout the day, which I have apparently misplaced. I need to look through the pile to see if I can find it here. Ah! Here we are. The Auto Assembly Cybertronian Times. Signed by everyone. Everyone I could get hold of anyway. Unfortunately, many guests were only available for the Saturday. But as you can see there, big names like David K. We have here, let's see, Greg Berger. Obviously, if you don't know who David K. and Greg Berger are, you probably should not be watching this video, or you've stumbled upon it randomly. Nick Roche, Kat Nicholson, there is a James Robertson up here. Everyone really put into this. Uh, I will not let go through this. Mal, you can enjoy this all you like, you can read through it, and you can spend all the time in the world deciphering this. But everything here, I believe that is everything done intently, well, apart from the large pile. I have a couple other things that I had signed, but it would take far too long to go across it. But this is Transformers 2011 Auto Assembly. The hall. I can do one last sweep. My pass over there. We are now nearing the 10 minute mark. So I will speed this up and say I hope that all of you enjoyed all assembly who attended, as myself, that everyone had a great time. I hope to see all of you next year. For Jasmine, who could not be here, and for Mal, hope you enjoy as well.